So I don't really know what kind of look this is and I don't know if you would ever even wear it But if you want to see how I did it, you can just keep watching it kind of was just like stuff was happening and I just went with it so If you want to see how I got this mess on my face, you can just keep watching and there's a little something right there Okay, yeah, go see it. Yeah, I'll take the color pink Moscato from Morphe first <laughs> And I'm gonna take it on. I'll take it on a big fluffy brush and kind of just put it everywhere. Just really putting it on there. I think these are Morphe. I think. Uh, the Morphe eyeshadow in Sweet Escape. And I'm going to take it on a Sigma E25. And I'm going to put it on like the outer corner. This is... I really got a lot of follow right there. These are all like shimmery shadows. So obviously if you don't want to do that, you can just switch them out for mattes. Okay, so now that I have a ton of fallout and I look sick, I am going to take that powder brush from dusting off my powder, extra powder, under my eyes, and flick this off. I have this new Sugar Pill eyeshadow that is partnered with the drag queen Kimchi, and it is a like turquoise blue. It's extremely pretty. Here, I'm trying to get you the true color. That's like the true color. It's very pretty. So that's what I'm gonna do along my bottom lash line, I think. Actually, hmm. It's insanely pigmented. Like I literally just like touched it. Um, actually, you know what? I might do eyeliner with it. Hmm. No, I'm gonna do my bottom lash line. Okay. Sigma F71 Detail Concealer Brush. That's what it looks like. And I will take some of this shadow on there. Tap it off, because it's very pigmented. And just... Here, I'll zoom you in a little. You're very far away. You'll see my very sick eyes now. They... They look this bad in person, too, so, yeah. This is kind of cute. Here. Really hope this doesn't turn out ugly. Because right now it looks really ugly. Okay. I'll take this teal eyeliner from Wet n Wild. It's in the color Misty Eyes. It's a little lighter than the eyeshadow, but it'll get the job done. I don't know how people put stuff in their water lines without pulling down their eye like, like this. I can't. I'll poke myself in the eye. I feel like I should add glitter. Mm, okay, I'm gonna take the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Liquid Glitter Eyeliner in Glam Rock. It is silver. And just paint it on there. I. I don't know why you would ever wear this look anywhere, but sometimes you just gotta mess around. I 
I don't know what the plan is here. I'll do white eyeliner because that ties in the uh, silver. So yeah, my battery's dying. That's cool. Well, I will put on some lashes and mascara and I'll be right back. Okay, so I put on my lashes and they're kind of ridiculous and I don't have a lash curler near me. So there's some issues, but I decided that I'm going to take my white eyeliner and make my bottom eyelashes white instead of black just to balance it out wow why are you not focused at all okay there we go so yeah taking actually a different white eyeliner this one's from wet and wild the other one was from sigma Go back to the usual Becca Pearl, and I'm going to take that Sigma FO3 High Cheekbone Highlighter, and I'm not actually going to spray it. This tutorial was a mess. I apologize. Just highlighting there. On my nose. Oh my god. Colourpop Marshmallow and Colourpop Petite 4 mixed together. I'll put Colourpop Sugar on top of it. Oh my god, it just fell out of the thing. Okay, so that's my lips. This look is kind of a mess. I don't really know what I'm doing. So thanks guys for watching. I don't know. I don't know. Give it a thumbs up if you thought it was interesting or entertaining or something. I'll see you guys next week. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye. The rest of everything I got are the some of the ultra satin lips lip thingies. I got six. So yeah.